42,000 subscriber rod and tackle unboxing. Subscribe. Hello and welcome. What's up, everybody? Thank you for clicking on the video and thank you for 42,000 subscribers here on YouTube. And you know what that means, man. Time to color in that 40-second bar on the subscriber board. Every bar represents 1,000 of you awesome people out there who have chosen to click the subscribe button here on this channel. I'm trying to fill the sucker in all the way to the top, though. Get that ultimate 100,000 subscriber goal and obtain the elusive YouTube silver play button so we can hang it up back there on the tackle wall. So if you're watching this and you haven't already subscribed, you're not in this awesome group of 42,000 people, Consider clicking that subscribe button and help me color in every single one of these suckers. We've got a little ways to go, but we've come a long ways as well. Can't do it without you. Thank you guys for all the love and support lately. I appreciate it. We're going to talk more about that in this video. We're also going to open all these packages that you see right here. As you can see, i got a few boxes. i got a couple rod tubes. And we're going to get off into all of this right here, right now in this video. I think I'm going to start with this one here with this guy right here it's a big one but it's also kind of the least exciting so we're gonna kick it off with this box right here from what's this say sunny sports scuba.com that doesn't really matter i ordered this off amazon but anyways i'll be right back i gotta go get my pocket knife all right here we go let's check it out you guys know anytime i get a fishing related item i try to Hang on to it as long as I can, keep myself from opening it so that we can do the unboxing here on camera together. And like I said, this item isn't exactly exciting, but I am excited to get out there and test it. This is a new life jacket. This is the Mustang Survival. Let's see. Not the Mustang Survival, not a cheap life jacket. So it's an automatic life vest the mustang survival hydrostatic inflatable pfd got the little gauge right here got your rip cord dirt to inflate first impressions it seems of higher quality than the last life vest that i was running which i'll show you i have it right here nothing wrong with it this i was running the onyx am24 and it's been a great vest for me. I've actually accidentally deployed this thing by either letting it sit out in the rain or accidentally dropping it over the gunnel of the boat like three times. All three times when this sucker got wet. Skadoosh! Full blown deployment. I have faith that that life jacket will work and deploy should I heaven forbid, end up in the water. That being said, this is a little bit of a higher quality life vest and I wanted to try it out. I have no affiliation with either one of these companies. I pay full price for this very expensive life vest. I'll link this bad boy down below in the video description if you're interested in checking it out for yourself. But this is gonna be the vest that I'm gonna be running in 2022. And now I'll have the old Onyx for whoever is tagging along in the boat if they want a, you know, a vest that's not so bulky and cumbersome like a traditional life vest you got the auto for the for the rider and the auto pfd for me as well mustang survival that's all i'm gonna say about that and uh, we're gonna go ahead and move on to some more stuff i'm gonna go ahead and grab this other big box right here i think i know what's in that one this one right here is the one we want to open next and then we'll take a look at the rods a lot of really cool stuff coming your way in this video. I'm gonna try to get through it, but we're also just gonna sit tight and have a nice fun unboxing. Cooper, Cooper's over here off, off camera, just chilling, sitting on the floor, watching us open these baits. But this is a big box of stuff that I needed from the six. You'll see why. Obviously you already see why. Some, one of the things in here is for the things that are in here, but there's also some baits in here as well. So let's crack off into this. This is a heavy one, dudes. Shout out to Bird Blades, the Bird Blades Mini Saloon. Such a killer little piece of EDC. My buddy, Bird Blades, is a uh, supporter of the channel. 
and I've been using his knives for a long time and yeah shout out to bird blades dude makes good stuff he's also a firefighter so happy to support people like that but check this out I needed some more of these bad boys right here. Sixth Sense makes some of the nicest, if not the nicest, rod sleeves in the game. These are the rod sleeves that I've been using for a long time. As you can see, I have a pile of them right here, and there's nothing wrong with these, actually. These all work great, and I still use them all. But I've also acquired some new rods here lately, and we're about to acquire a few more. So I had to grab rod sleeve after rod sleeve after rod sleeve after rod sleeve you get the idea you get the idea man it's a big box full of six cents fishing rod sleeves for all the new heaters i'm going to take a look at some more new rods here in just a second don't worry but anytime the white boxes show up that's how you know it's fun that's how you know it's it's getting Serious. This right here. Mm -hmm. Six cents fishing Devon swim jig in pro blue, half ounce. That's it. Got 10 of those suckers. Five in this box, five in this box. Boom, good to go. I also got another bait that I've been loving that I want to load up on. Talking, of course, about the Crush 50 Ghost Bone Minnow. I'm in love with this color. It's quickly becoming one of my favorites, if not my favorite Chad imitator. The Ghost Bone Minnow. Yeah. Mm. My clear water. It's a killer. I've been fishing with it. I've been catching with it. And I think I had like one of these. And I was like, dude, I do not want to run out. So five here, five here. 10 and 10, good to go. Devon swim jigs, rod sleeves, crush 50s in the ghost bone minnow smoke. Hey, I'm happy about that right there. That's good, that's good stuff. Shout outs to the six. They always take good care of us. And this little package right here is no different. I'm excited to uh, get off into this tube and show you guys what's in here. This one, it's got some serious heat in it. And I'm not jackalacking around here, boys. I'm talking fire, fire smoke off in here. Here you go. All right, I need to figure out which one is which because I want to open one first. Let me see what I got here really quick. All right, this is the tube we need to open last. <laughs> Let's set that over here. This one right here we're going to crack into first. All right, because this tube right here is a tube full of heaters. And you guys have already seen these rods here on this channel. Go check out the launch video that I did here on the channel when we first released these bad boys. But basically what's in this little bundle right here is one of each of the heater series rods so that I would have myself, you see that rubber band go flying? Would have myself. So that I would have myself some backups. I didn't want to be unable to get myself a, a, a backup or a replacement once they sold out, which is already happening, guys. This one right here in particular, the 7.2 medium heavy mod fast heater series chatterbait rod. Shout outs to everybody that bought one of these. This one, I just found out earlier before I started filming this video, this bad boy is sold out. Sold all the way out, man. Isn't that cool? It, uh, it means a lot to me that so many of you guys will go out and pick up a heater series rod and support the heater series like you have. I knew they were going quick from what I could see and I knew it wouldn't be long before we had some sell out and the first model has officially sold out. So I'm stoked on that. I feel like the next two to go are gonna be the 7.4 medium heavy mod fast heater series swim jig rod and the 6.9 medium. There's only a few of these left. So if you guys were on the fence, you wanna check out the heater series rod, don't wait. I would say get on it right now before these suckers are gone because it won't be long now, especially for those last two that I just showed you. Check out the heater series, sixcentsfishing.com. It's my own signature series of fishing rods that I worked with Sixth Sense to develop. They're now available to the public. Get in on the heater series. 
support the movement. Shout out to everybody that already bought a heater series rod. Thank you guys for the support. Selling out of that chatterbait rod really means a lot to me. Here's the rod right here if you guys want to see it. These are the rods that you guys are going to see me using going forward for the most part. And I couldn't be more grateful and excited to be a part of this project, to have you guys be able to be a part of it by owning the same rods that you guys see me use here on the channel. I think they turned out amazing. And uh, yeah, that's what was in that first tube. I had to go grab one of each. I got myself one more of each so that I wouldn't be without in case I happen to, gosh forbid, smash one of these bad boys in the truck door or something. But I got some ideas for some of these. I'm gonna get them laced up. We'll have them ready to go soon. And uh, yeah, that's what's in here. If you guys wanna see the heater series rod more up close, check out the other videos that I've already done. I'm not gonna like beat it into the ground too much. I feel like I'm sort of doing that here again in this one already. But like I said, I am extremely excited and just found out a little bit ago that this, this rod right here that I have in my hand, no longer, no longer available. We sold them all. Stoked, man. Thank you guys so much for the support. But this next tube is also equally exciting because what's in here? This is some fire too. And I'm just as excited to get my hands on these bad boys as I was slash am to finally have my hands on the heater series. So these right here, this is the new new. Six Sense Fishing recently branched out into the high end custom rod market. And these right here are two of their 100% USA made custom swim bait rods and I am very excited to try these bad boys. Dude. Handmade in the USA. Sorry, this is my first time seeing these, so I'm gonna take it in a little bit here with you guys. First thing I notice is they, they come with a really nice high quality rod sleeve. Like, there's a nice rod sleeve in there on both of these. And then I'm just looking at the tags here. Let's check them out. USA series, handmade in the USA. Six cents fishing rods. It's upside down, but you guys get it. All right, let's cut them apart. I'm just doing this slowly. I'm, I've lost my pocket knife, but I'm, what I was gonna say is I'm very happy and I feel fortunate to have these rods in my possession. And I'm gonna tell you why. I feel that way here a little bit more in just a second. Share my feelings, I just gotta find my knife. All right, I found it. You always, you set stuff down. You set stuff down, boys, in the garage, it's gone, that's it. It's over with. But anyways, I'll tell you guys something. I'll tell you guys something about old Jay Roy. I've been fishing my whole life and I've been pretty serious about this whole bass fishing thing for a few years now. If you guys have been following along on the channel, Bought my first bass boat ever just a few years ago. And then now we're on our second bass boat and tackle pile, tackle mile. Our entire life has been consumed by bass fishing. But that being said, your boy has never owned or fished with a 100% USA made custom rod, never. Never had anything like this. Never been able to use anything like this. So, to say I'm excited is an understatement. I'm extremely excited. They've got these wrapped really well. So I'm gonna cut through the rest of this plastic and I'll be right back with you guys. I don't want you to have to listen to me talk over all this crinkling and popping. We're almost there guys. They got them wrapped good, which is a good thing. All right, here we are. All right, boys, here we are. Six Sense Custom USA Series rods in hand. This thing feels incredible. It already feels good. I can't wait to get this thing out of here. All right, this is the 7-Eleven Multi-Purpose Heavy. So, you'll be able to do a lot with this one. Woo! The USA Series. 7-Eleven Heavy, American Forged Snagless Guides. Let's take it all in, dudes. Let's just take it all in. 7-Eleven Heavy. 
Got the full grip. Multi-purpose. Made in USA. I'm gonna turn it over, don't worry. Just letting you guys get a good look at everything here. It is light. This thing is light for a 7-Eleven. It feels nice. Check that out, dude. Look, look at that. That's just, oh, all right. Spin a Rooney. And there you go, guys. Made in USA. Multi-purpose heavy, six cents fishing. Got your line weight, lure weight, length and power. Let's go ahead and give it a little. Oh yeah, it's got a nice parabolic bend to it, man. That's nice, sweet. Six cents USA series, 7-Eleven heavy multi-purpose. All kinds of stuff comes to mind when I hold that rod. Swim baits, deep, deep cranking. Mm. This one right here, 7.4, mag heavy. I'll take a look at the weight ratings on these rods here in just a second together. I'm taking my time for you guys, trying to let you get a good first impression so we can soak these rods in together. Okay, so this one, 7.4 mag heavy. It says for baits up to one and one half ounce. This one, 7.11 heavy, rated for baits up to six ounces. So there's your swim bait heater right there, guys. This one right here, rated for baits up to one and a half ounce. So I'll tell you what, man, let's bust the phone out and let's take a little look at what Sixth Sense has to say on their website about these rods. I can tell you guys a little bit more about the USA series. USA custom rods made in the USA. Custom designed to a specific rod length and action. So you got the split grip handle on this one and then you got the full foam grip handle on the bigger swim bait rod. This one I have in my hand, the 7.4 Six Cents, says that this right here was built for frogging, jigging, heavy flipping. So there you go. I also think this would make a great rod for the trace. Yeah, awesome. So I needed a good heavy jig, heavy frog, heavy flipping stick. And this right here, this uh, six cents fishing mag heavy, that might be the way to get it done. That might be the move, huh? What kind of reel should I put on this? You guys go down in the comments right now and let me know which Shimano I should lace up on this. What, should I go with the 8.5? How, how should I play this on, on the 7.4 mag heavy? Cause I know what to do with the swim with the swim bait rod. I got that. I'm gonna throw a six one on there, and we're gonna be throwing something heavy. But what should I do with this one? Should it be an eight five or a seven to one? You guys, let me know in the comments what reel I should throw on this seven four mag heavy six cents fishing USA custom series rod. Cannot wait to get out there on the water with these things. If you guys want to see me fishing with both of these rods, if you guys want to see what reels I end up putting on these rods, make sure you subscribe to the channel. All that's coming your way really soon. You know, I keep the cameras rolling so that I can bring you guys along for these adventures and we can experience these things together. I appreciate you guys for helping me reach 42,000, but we have a lot more left to do here on this channel. So if you're watching, subscribe and help us grow this beast and uh, we'll figure out what to do with these rods together. I can't wait to get them laced up, get out there fishing, never fished with 100% USA made custom rods like this before. These are next level. I feel extremely blessed and uh, yeah, can't wait to, to use them and I will make sure I'll tell you guys more about them in the future videos. Stoked on that. Whoa, a lot of heat dropping in this one. We got five more heater series rods, two USA custom series rods. Heaters only, heaters only from the six. And you know what's cool about these USA series is they came with their own rod sleeves. So, I mean, that, really that saves money. I won't, have to, I won't have to use two of my other rod sleeves, my brand new ones. I can save those for all the heater series rods and my Lux series rods and my sensory series rods, my Team 6 rods. I love all the rods that Six Sense makes. I throw Six Sense fishing rods exclusively. I'm also blessed to have my own line of rods through them. It means a lot to me to see you guys using the heater series, but I assure you, if you try any of their stuff, you will not be disappointed. I hear nothing but good things all the time about how much people love their rods. If you want to check them out, sixcentsfishing.com. JR10 is going to save you 10% off your entire order. So if you go order $1,000 worth of rods, 10% off is a good little chunk of savings. So thank you guys once again for all the love and support on the 
heater series launch but if you want to check out those usa custom series rods that i just showed you for those of you guys that like high-end gear these bad boys are available now and they're coming in just under 400 bucks so good deal on these i've seen similar rods priced higher and these right here obviously haven't fished with them yet but these feel and look on another level from any rod that i've ever owned in my life i mean you really just have to see these things in person to, to be able to to capture the level of detail i mean look at the blank inside there first of all this i don't even know what's going on it's they're light they're extremely light the action on this the swim bait rod multi-purpose heavy 7-eleven this is the one you want if you're gonna go swim bait fishing this right here they say this is good for frogging and flipping so this might be my new flipping stick once again you guys let me know what reels we should throw on these bad boys Let's go ahead and round out this unboxing. I got one more box right here. To show you guys some new baits I'm excited about. We're gonna make some noise in the springtime, hopefully tick off a couple spawning females that are ready to unleash the fury on some moving baits. These baits right here, six cents recently released. I had to get my hands on some, make a little noise. This is the new XR series of baits. Let's check them out. So, XR, what's that mean? Whoa, check out that color. That's that craw. Fire! XR, extra rattles, extra loud. Yeah, more of like a, almost like a, that's just an extremely loud. I don't know what they've done inside of there. There's a, not a one knocker sound, there's multiple rattles. But there's one larger chamber in there with one heavier rattle that's making a whole lot of noise on these new crush 50 xrs they also have the new crush 100 xr this is that 4k shad we'll bust out every one of these and look at the colors together but mainly i wanted to get a listen first my lord they're loud i don't know how i don't know if, if the microphone on this camera is doing these dang things justice but i mean did you rattle them up next to your ear hello and you already know the the, the paint schemes are heaters only from the six this is that 4k shad one of my favorites another one of my favorites just a killer clear water shad imitator but they got the bold and the beautiful too if you like those loud and proud colors like that right there that craw fire let's take a look at some of these other ones this one right here the black magic crush 50 xr the Black Magic is a six cents staple. Love that bait right there. I'm sure you guys do too. Loud, bold color, loud, bold sound. That one's fire. You know what? Got a bunch of these in here. We're gonna have to give some away. You guys watch the end of the video if you wanna know how to get your hands on one of these baits right here. I'm gonna give some of these away. The 50 4K Shad XR. Another 100, this is that shad burst color. That right there is a killer murky water. When the water's just a little murky and you want a little bit of flash, but see on the bottom there, it's ghosted out. You can still see through it. Still has a natural look, but it just has added flash for a little extra attention. And now, even more extra attention. Man, these things got the freaking amplifiers on i'm gonna give you guys i'm gonna give away some of these baits in this video so watch till the end here i'm gonna tell you guys how to win some of these new xr is that black magic crush 100 xr that right there is sick the craw fire boiled crawfish springtime heater right there you just want to just go all out and be as bold and obnoxious as possible the crush 100 this larger profile compared to the 50 here's the 50 here's the 100 this right here smoke show of a color super vibrant i mean that's going to be an attention getter in that murky water and those rattles man you can hear those things coming from a mile away for sure but let's go ahead and give away some baits man Let's go with these bad boys, man. Let's give away some black magic here in this video. One, Crush 50 XR and Crush 100 XR. The all new, super loud, extra rattle in one of their signature 
staple colors super easy to enter all you gotta do click the thumbs up button on this video make sure you're subscribed to the channel then go down below and leave me a comment let me know how you found my channel what you enjoy about my channel and why you need these baits right here and then wifey and i will go through we'll read all your comments and we'll pick somebody together to win these two crush xr crankbaits from six cents fishing so like the video subscribe to the channel and drop me a comment and i will get those sent out to you asap Thank you guys so much for all of the support lately. Thank you for helping me hit 42,000 subscribers here on the channel. Thanks for supporting the Heater Series launch. I could never say thank you enough. You guys that ride with me, man, it's, it's unreal. And massive shout outs to the Heater Army. If you guys like what I do over here on YouTube, consider becoming a channel member, join the Heater Army. Shout outs to all the JR10 users. Once again, you can check out the rods that I showed you in this video or the new Crush XR series of baits from Sixth Sense Fishing on SixthSenseFishing.com. Use my code JR10 to save 10% off everything on on the website. Using that JR10 code is absolutely the number one way that you guys can support the channel and help us keep the lights on and the cameras rolling so that we can continue to bring you free fishing content over here on YouTube. And as always, anyone who uses that JR10 code, automatic shout out on my Instagram story. My JR10 riders already know the deal. Just send me a screenshot of your order confirmation. I'm going to post it up, tag your account. It's just a way for me to give you all some public recognition and say thank you for keeping these cameras running because without you guys, we could not do this. This is a team effort, two-way street. What we've built together here is incredible for such a small channel. 42,000, man. That's nothing in the grand scheme of things here on YouTube. I feel like our energy is monumental. It's a force to be reckoned with and we're not stopping anytime soon. We're going to keep pushing this thing. I'm going to keep working, grinding, and growing for as long as it takes to achieve my goals. I will stubbornly continue to fish, film, and fail upward right here on YouTube until I get those bars filled in on that subscriber board or until they delete the website, one or the other. Thank you guys so much for riding with me. I could not do this without you. It means the world to me that you take time out of your day to watch these videos. So thank you. I appreciate it. But that's about all I got for you today. That about does it. That about wraps her on up. So I'm going to say goodbye for now and I'll see you in the next one. Peace. <laughs> gotcha. You wanna take it